Hello, I am Dr. Che and you are watching my YouTube channel. In this video, we will talk about food and diet. Food and diet. This is video number one and this is the English vocabulary in general for any English learner and in particular for IELTS and TOEFL students. So please look at description box for updates and link to my Facebook group. Please like and comment to encourage me. Please share to help other students and subscribe to my channel to look more courses on free courses on grammar, writing, speaking, listening and reading. So as you know, I have uh, uh, covered more than 27 common topics for IELTS and TOEFL students and uh, nowadays we are at a food and diet and uh, to watch my complete course open playlist of my channel and watch complete course in order link is given below in the description so our first word in food and diet is cuisine cuisine look at the spelling c u i s i n e this is not the same as cousin okay this is cuisine uh, pronunciation is different and spelling is different cuisine it is a noun and mostly it will be used in topic of food and diet it is a style of cooking that is particular to a country or an area spelling is of course very important in collocations we can use an italian cuisine a japanese cuisine a french cuisine an indian cuisine a, okay and the restaurant the restaurant is renowned for its indian cuisine okay we prepared a local cuisine for the party we prepared local cuisine for the party cuisine is very important note it down in your notebook organic produce organic produce is a collocation organic produce is noun and collocation plants or animals produced naturally without use of chemicals are artificial food these are organic food organic produce or organic food the food is that produced produce is food or other things that are grown in large quantities to be sold okay produce is a food or other thing that is grown in large quantity to sold but organic produce only produces food or things that are grown in large quantities to so to sell them but organic is that is animals or plants or food that is produced naturally without use of chemicals or artificials crops animals plants or any food okay this is organic produce the quality of organic produce produce has increased enormously in the recent years look at the high level vocabulary the collocations we can use an agricultural produce fresh produce fresh produce you will use in in your uh, task one in task one and speaking and uh, writing always is a homegrown produce organic and seasonal produce organic produce seasonal produce we can also say organic food instead of uh, produce we can say also food snack is a noun it means a very small amount of food that we eat between our meals or in hurry usually i only have a snack at lunch time instead of eating frequent snacks it is better to eat only three meals instead of eating frequent snacks it is better to eat only three meals nutrient nutrient is a noun it means a substance that a living organism need to live and grow it is a substance that a living organism need to live and grow this is nutrient is important word nutrient collocations we can use essential nutrients that are important that are obligatory for our uh, over growth and non-essential that we use from outside that are not essential that are not important but they can be produced in our body essential that we need from outside 
don't don't be confused these are medical terms but we use essential that are important non essential that are not important nutrients adjective is nutritious something that is nutritious nutritious adjective very important keep it in your mind nutritious nutrient at one place use nutrient another place is nutritious this will change your vocabulary range of vocabulary will be high and you will get more higher score children from poor families often suffer from essential nutrient deficiencies children that from from poor families often suffer from essential nutrient deficiencies deficiencies fruit and vegetables contain vital nutrients food and fruit and vegetables remember fruit plural of fruit is fruit without s fruit and vegetables contain vital nutrients a balanced food is naturally rich in a lot of vitamins and other nutrients it is rich in vitamins and nutrients scrumptious scrumptious very good word look at the spelling scrumptious synonyms are delicious delicious yummy mouth watering something that is very delicious yummy mouth watering oh yummy or yummy i don't uh, know exactly around a food that is very tasty that is very tasty scrumptious his wedding cake was absolutely absolutely scrumptious his wedding cake was absolutely scrumptious those uh, scrumptious chocolates chocolate is very important word for as you you are listening spelling is important for listening those scrumptious chocolates are loved by every tourist overeating to eat more than normal than more than you need to live okay overeating is skipping your dinner can result in overeating this is sentence when you skip your dinner it can result in overeating because after that uh, you will eat more appetite a double p appetite a feeling to eat a mother should feed her children regularly if she want to curb their appetite if she wa- don't want any problem with their appetite she want to she should uh, feed them regularly malnourished mal malnourished mal you can say mal- malnourished malnourished is ma- most common malnourished is adjective some people say also malnourished malnourished is adjective it mean to be in bad health because of a uh, because of lack of good quality and quantity of food there is insufficient quantity and quality of food and in the children and uh, an adult is in bad health because of that more than 10 million children in developing in developing countries are malnourished or malnourished malnourished children are often prone to serious infections food poisoning you can say food poisoning you can say food borne illnesses or illness is it is an illness caused by eating unhealthy or contaminated food it can be unhealthy or contaminated food and it is illness caused by eating this food which leads to vomiting diarrhea stomach pain okay these are food poisoning many people suffer suffered from food poisoning because of eating undercooked food undercooked food you can use in when you are writing undercooked food poisoning poisoning okay eating processed you know what is processed food i will explain later on eating processed food often cause food poisoning ingredients very important word ingredients it is a noun it mean parts of a mixture like of a food of a dish what are the ingredients what is included in our, in that food or dish we should avoid those ingredients that trigger food allergy we should avoid those ingredients that trigger that stimulate that stimulate that cause that trigger food allergy okay 
थैंक यू वेरी मच इफ यू हैव नॉट सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब फॉलो द लिंक बिलो एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच